Greetings, I am Cross Knights, and this is Let's Play Donkey Kong Country Tres. And we're moving on on our quest to find our Donkey Kong and Diddy Kong, I think. That's, that's the plot, right? I really hope that's the plot, and I didn't tell everything, every the wrong thing last time, but I'm pretty sure, pretty sure that's the plot. I think so. It's interesting that there's a snow level already. <laughs> I will say there's... There's quite a variance of levels on the first stage, even. I mean, I guess that's kind of cool. Yeah. Why would a snowman need a scarf, perhaps? Wouldn't that make him melt faster? Hmm. You should give him a necklace of ice cubes. That would probably be... Yeah. That's what I have to say. Stop Stop assuming that snowmen are like you. Don't get them scarves. Get them necklaces made out of ice cubes. That'd be great. I think they'd appreciate it more, to be honest. Bash the baddies, of course. I need to kill all... Uh, enemies. However, <laughs> I meant to tell you and not show you. Uh, if you get hit at any time, you lose the stage. Oh, no, no, no! Damn it. Pfft. I have 14 lives, really. Of course, I believe this game employs the system that if you reset the game, you lose all your lives. Yeah. But, uh, that's not a problem right now. But yeah, any bonus stage, if you get hit once, you lose the bonus stage. It doesn't matter if you have two people. But it, would, it makes, like, double sense on the stage where you have to kill all the enemies that you shouldn't get hit. Because otherwise, what's the challenge? Hit, 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 yeah. So even he can reach it, that's kind of cool. Let's try to not be stupid this time. Beard, oh, just, yeah, but, yeah, yeah, yeah. Kapow. There we are. Almost screwed that up. I only had one second left. That's fine. We be moving on ice. Midway point. As I said before, I'm going to get all the bonus things, but I'm probably not going to show all the... Son of a... You are too strong! You throw too far. Pop. I swear it does get more complicated. Well, last episode you saw it was more complicated. I had to, like, throw it through a metal door and stuff. Hee <laughs> hee. That was close. Oh, good. Such weird enemies. <laughs> it's like you enemies are out of place. You can't even walk on the ground that you live in. Okay. Kapow. Kapow. No, no, no. <laughs> I somehow knew I wouldn't be able to jump in time. I really want to do that, though. You let me back. You let me back. You let... Uh, all right, looks like we're using Dixie. Dixie Cup Kong. Not gonna screw up this time. Oh, no, no, no. Ha <laughs> ha! Like a pro. Bam! More scarf snowmen. Pop. Whee! Hat. You can also kind of create attack combos like you could in the other one. Like, if there's a bunch of guys in a row and you spin, uh, every time you hit something when you spin, it can it causes you to spin again. Maybe not the easiest thing to understand unless I showed you, but there's no opportunity to show you just yet. Murky Mill. Oh, see, here's where things start to get stupid as far as I'm concerned. Because uh, I seem to remember there being a bunch of backtracking in this, but maybe it's not this one yet. It's not until I get to those weird lava stages, I think. Uh, so yeah. Oh, by the way, did I mention, uh, Ellie the Elephant? That's probably not his name. I'm gonna call him Ellie, though, because I don't remember his real name. He's scared of mice. So, <clears throat> if you see a mouse, if he sees a mouse, he will become scared and run away, and you won't be able to jump on them. However, if you, if you attack them from a certain angle or throw a barrel at them, you can kill them. But you have to be careful. Also, it appears that I actually turned into the elephant. I'm not riding him. So that's a bit weird. <laughs> there, see? He just ran away. If I had jumped from a certain angle, it would have been fine. It's just he can't see it. If he sees it, he runs away. And that's from, like, an old, uh... It's a cartoon thing, like, all mice eat cheese constantly. It's that, uh... Oh, God. It's that elephants are afraid of mice. Eat a barrel. Now... That's... okay. Ah, I knew it. I was like, normally those trapdoors don't do anything, but when there's a bee over it, that's very suspicious. So it looks like... 
I think he's the only the first animal companion ever that can pick up barrels. Because he sucks them in with his trunk. So that's cool. And then he runs in place like a weirdo. Uh, is it the light? Is it like I can't attack a rat if it's in a light source? Maybe that's it. Hello? Yeah. Oh. This old shtick. Hut. Come back to me. Nice. Yep, I need all the DK coins and all the bonus coins and all the something else I haven't found yet, so I'm not going to mention it. Oh, crap. No! Damn it. Looks like I need to bring a barrel up here. That's the type of crap I'm talking about, though. Like, instead of just flowing through the level, they force you to backtrack, because you don't know that that mouse is up there at first. Maybe you take the barrel, or maybe you assume that it was for the other part. But either way, if you screw it up, you have to backtrack a bunch. It wasn't like that in the other Donkey Cogs. You only backtracked if you freaking died. Yeah. Whoa. Nah. Okay. We're good. Regenerating barrels. I feel like I should get another one, because they're going to spring a mouse on me. I know it. There he is. <laughs> You see that? If I didn't have that instinct, I would have had to go... Oh, God. Oh, look at that! I can suck in barrels! Okay, that part is actually cool, because it teaches you. It's a teaching moment. That's why there was bananas in the shape of a Y. It's showing you that you can suck in barrels. Hit. Hmm. Aha! Nice! Can you come to me this time? A little bit closer. A little bit closer? <laughs> All right, apparently I can't put that in my trunk space. Oh, I didn't need to. It was a trick. It was a ruse! Okay. Oh, jeez, I have to dodge this. Yeah. Hut. Hut. Okay. Hut. Oh, okay. I was figuring there was going to be another one that was really fast or something. Yeah! Let's ride. Oh... Oh, well. <laughs> What's she gonna do? Wham! Hopefully there'll be a buddy barrel nearby. Because I need a buddy. So otherwise I get hit once and... Uh, there we go. Buddy! Buddy Barrelson. Hut! Cool. I'm gonna pull this off this time. I'll be the best elephant that you've ever seen. Better than Dumbo and that elephant that paints. Yeah. Pop! And we'll kill all of the rats. Ha! All rats shall be eaten. Ah, I get. Uh. Bam! I'm not gonna be able to kill that other one, though. Dun, da, da, da. Barrel ho! Pop. You and you. Oh, son of a. Can't you just let me go? Why are you so mean? Making me go all the way back here. Man! Hmm. <laughs> ha! Son of. Kill him. Yes! <laughs> Take that! I don't go back twice. Except that time that I went back twice, but that time wasn't one of those times. Woohoo! Ooh, it's Swanky's Sideshow. You might remember Swanky from the second game. Um. Hmm. I don't really want to play this. I don't remember what you have to do. Ah, screw it, I'll play one game, because I don't remember how to do it. Head-to-head, -head, race to 25 endurance. Head-to-head! -head. I don't remember how to play this. <laughs> I don't remember what to do! Oh, look, it's Cranky Cog. Oh, jeez. Hmm. Oh, I just... That's it? That's... 
straightforward at least, except I'm failing. Because I'm apparently not fast enough. Alright, so head to head is I just need to get more than him. And you can see on the side uh, how far ahead I am. If you get five points ahead, you automatically win. And I got five points ahead. And I automatically won. Take that. You're dumb. What do I win, sir? Bananas, bananas, and bananas, and bear coins! I like it. And we're at a bird? This is a level. I kind of want to uh, go back here first, because I just realized there's a shop in the center of the island that I totally ran past before. What do you have to sell, sir? Ah, oh, hello there. How's it going? Barnacle's my name, and I don't care what you say anymore. What was that? Oh, he's got a bird he wants to give me. Is that it? Did I... Maybe I should actually read what he said, because I don't know why he... I want that bird! Hmm. It looks like, because he's not taking money... That means that there's an object somewhere that I can get that I need to give him, and then he'll give me that bird. No, that's not- I didn't want to go there! For son of a- son of a- Yeah, to get out of the level- I think only once you've beaten it, but to get out of the level, you just did start and select. Alright, so I think this is a boss. Are you indeed a boss? Do I- can I actually just jump and- Yeah, okay. Cause you heavy- Oh god! What do I... What do I do? Wait, what? What do I do with this beetle? Oh, I can throw it! Eat it! Do I have to get it in his mouth? Because that would make sense. Let's try to not kill the beetles that I need to use to destroy him. Hmm. That's gotta be what I have to do, though. What else could I do? Let's try... Try her. There we go. <laughs> yeah, it looks like it's a lot easier to get her to throw it in. He's just not at the right height, I guess. Nope. <laughs> looks like I do have to put a little more effort into it. Yeah. Okay. I think if I get pushed, like if he keeps on going, he'll push me off that ledge, and I'll, I'll die in the phase. Ha! Um, bam? Yeah! Right in your teeth. I don't think he's taking damage. I think I have to push him all the way back. That means I lost a lot of ground before. Oh, too high. Can't let him go forward. Yeah. Oh, he can't even damage me. What a dork. Yes! A little bit further, fool. Your demise is... Close at hand! Is that it? No, a little bit further! Yeah, no, come on! We must do it! Together! We can kill sentient barrels! Ha! Just try getting out of there, barrel! What the? I got shot out of a cannon. Well, if I didn't want to be shot out of a cannon. Oh, by the way... Kablam! There's hidden islands all over the thing, which I guess is, is a cool reason- Wait, am I gonna be able to do this? Good, my controller was set up properly. It's a bird! It looks eerily similar to that bird that that other guy had. Interesting. Are there any other islands I can get to? Or secret islands? Hmm. How do I drive this thing? There we go. I think... Oh, I can't go over these. Alright. So for now, no. There are no other secret islands I can go to. I can go to a new area, however. Well, let me just... Let me just check in real quick. Right here. 
Rankless Save Cave. Oh, I love this bird that you found. It's an energetic little thing, isn't it? So anytime you find a banana bird, which is what they're called, you notice they look they actually look like banana peels with wings on them. <laughs> um, you can come here, and Wrinkly Kong will take care of the banana bird. And you notice there's actually a slot for banana birds. I found one. I think there's 30, but I could be totally wrong about that. Cool. And he mentions that Cranky Kong is spending all of his time at Swanky's bonus games. Instead of being a good husband and being inattentive. Did I mention the horrible, horrible thing that happens to Wrinkly Kong in Donkey Kong 64? It'll blow your mind. That's why I shouldn't even say it. It's too, it's too horrible. I don't know what the developers were thinking. It was messed up. They were just so cavalier about it. But, ah, I was traumatized. I was traumatized the first time I saw it. Not really, but I, I was shot. No, the first time I saw it, I was I was vaguely traumatized. It's vaguely traumatized what they did to Wrinkly Kong in Donkey Kong 64. Donkey Kong 64, by the way, not a bad game. Maybe one day. One day. Also, might have the most ridiculous intro song ever. <laughs> Possibly, it's possible it's the most ridiculous intro song ever. It may be a rap about Donkey Kong and his crew. It might be. <laughs> In fact, you should look up the intro to Donkey Kong 64, and you see the power. The power that is the intro. <laughs> yeah. So now we're in the forest, I see. No! That's what I get for not paying attention. Although they really didn't give me that much time to think about that, did they? Yep, that's right. I'm blaming them. Not my fault. I'm infallible. Yep. No, get up there. Get up there, Dixie. Whistling Dixie. Okay. Uh, if I stay, I need that K. Okay. Yep. Blocked. There's barrel shields. Yep. Stupid monkeys standing there all day in their tree, always throwing things, even when no one's there. Psychotic bastards. Ah. Da 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 da! Blocked. Blocked. Let's do it. Yep. I needed those bananas desperately. Wait, what's down here? Victory! Oh, just a, just a bear coin. Patterns. God, that didn't sound annoying at all. Oh, cool. I blew a hole in the wall. Find the coin! Will do, as long as it's not collect stupid green bananas, it'll do anything you want. It's really the only bonus game that I extremely have massive dislike for. Gotcha. I will stay, like, this is 2011. These graphics still look really good. I gotta say, this was one of the last games on the Super Nintendo, so it makes sense. Oh, crap. Stepping up the difficulty, I say. I can dig it. Can you? Ow! She can't. She couldn't dig it at all. We'll just have to dig without her. Is your gigant- Uh, nope! <laughs> I wasn't able to keep my gigantic body behind that shield. He was like, BAM! Foot! My weakness, the foot. Where did they start me? Oh well, it don't matter. Keep going! Don't fear the cocoa nuts. Whoa, just dead. Now! Any more? Yep. Oh god, dead. Ah ha Ninja. Ninja. Rap? Oh god. Hut! Can I get up there? Let me see here. Switch. That branch looks suspicious to me. I was right. I do like a lot of the like so-called puzzles in this are just observational. Like you see something out of place, and you should investigate it. Gadget. That one you have to make sure you're not standing too far over. It's not gonna hit him from behind. And why would I need this TNT to blow through here? Shortcut. 
Stupid monkey defense security thing. He didn't work that time. I just got past it. Ooh, it's the G. Did I mention the Kong? Like, all that does is gives you an extra life. You can get all four letters of Kong in every stage. Ain't no thing. On a side note, I know since recently that I've been saying ain't a lot. And I don't know why. I mean, it's not a bad thing. It's just I'm, I'm confused as to when it started and why it's happening. Like, really confused. Like, no one in my area says ain't. At least, maybe they do, and I haven't been paying attention, and it seeps into my subconscious. Or if I've been watching videos where people say ain't? I really don't know, but I'm very confused by it. I just, I just want to know. That's all. <laughs> I don't get why I do things. As Wrinkly Kong has another save cave, and magically warps in between them, playing her mystical N64, except when she passes out due to the fact that she's old, I will stop here. Kabam. And resume next time as we go through the Forest of Eternal Sorrow. It probably has a happier name than that. Like, uh, I don't know. Forest of Festering Pain. It's probably the Forest of Festering Pain. Alright, I'll see you guys next time, and we will fester some pain. <laughs>